Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the dev channel, which is the build 23619. In this video, as always, we're going to talk about everything that is new, new changes, improvements, fixes, and all the risk to it. And I can tell you that this build is a little bit more exciting than the previous one. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. Those things being said, let's begin with the video. First of all, Microsoft is introducing a new feature for Windows that introduces the ability to effortlessly access and edit your most recent photos and screenshots from your Android mobile device and snipping tool on your PC. With this feature, you'll receive instant notifications on your PC whenever a new photo or screenshot is captured on your Android device. And to enable this experience, you're going to have to go into the settings app, then go into the Bluetooth and devices section, then mobile devices, and make sure you connect your phone using phone link to your Windows 11 operating system. And this new experience will replace the remote capture with phone link that was announced back in September. Related to the start menu, for people logged into Windows 11 Pro or Enterprise Editions with a Microsoft Entry ID account, Microsoft is trying out the ability to view and join upcoming Microsoft Teams meetings directly from the start menu. The next online Teams meetings will show up as a recommended item five minutes before it begins. Clicking the meeting recommendation will open the join meeting flow in Teams. Also, there are some more improvements related to the new features in Windows Copilot. If we were to copy a text, then hover over the Copilot icon. Now the bottoms work. If we click on summarize, we will be able to send this to Copilot to summarize it for us. I think that is pretty nice. Of course, you need to have some coherent text in order for this to work properly. And as you can see now, it just generated the summary for some previous commands that I've sent to it, but it's okay. Microsoft is working on it, and I think this is pretty good. And they are also working on making this possible for images, as you saw on a previous video that I've done. We also have some options related to images inside Copilot. Related to fixes in File Explorer, Microsoft did some work to help improve the launch performance of File Explorer. Also, related to the the task manager. If you fix an issue where dragging the task manager window wouldn't work if your mouse was on the search box and some other fixes. They fixed the crash when you tried to add natural voices for narrator in settings. So basically this is all there is to it to the latest Windows 11 and Saturday preview build for the dev channel. If you want to check out all the known issues in this build, you can check the article below in the video description. Those things being said, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TickPage channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I'm Ozzy from TickPage. Until next time, have a nice day.